Thanks to the figure you see here, you can easily derive the expansion of cosine of x plus y. First, let's complete our setup here. Here, I see an angle of x plus y from alternate interior angles. That means this part will also be x plus y. I've labeled this angle as y. I can call the angle here the complement of y. Since this is 90 degrees and the total here is 180 degrees, the angle here will be its complement. That is y. In this right triangle, I see that my hypotenuse is 1. So I can write sine x for the side opposite x and cosine x for the adjacent side. Now, I see the angle y here and my hypotenuse here is cosine x. So, to find the adjacent side of y, I need to multiply cosine x by cosine y. Let's write that down. Similarly, when we look at the right triangle here, our hypotenuse is 1. So, for the adjacent side of x plus y here, we can write 1 times cosine of x plus y or simply cosine of x plus y for short. When we look at the right triangle here, our hypotenuse is sine x, and here we see the angle y. So, for the side opposite the angle y, we can say sine x times sine y. Now, to find this line segment here, it will be enough to subtract this line segment from the short side of the rectangle. Let's write down what I just said. Cosine of x plus y equals the short side of the rectangle minus this side here. In this way, we've found the expansion of cosine of x plus y.